Welcome back to another episode on Beho Reviews in Gaming and Entertainment. Today we discuss a new chapter on gaming. Games that are just too frustrating to complete. I love video games, but there are times where you just need to quit and move on. In this episode, we talk about Remnant from the Ashes on the Xbox One, PS4, and PC. Using the Unreal 4 engine, Remnant from the Ashes was released in 2019 by Gunfire Games. You start in a post-apocalyptic world where Earth has been taken over by an evil called The Root. You are basically trying to rid The Root in efforts to return the world to its former glory. And when I say trying, I mean you are really dying. This game takes its gameplay mechanics from the Soul series that that just means that it's trying to punish you until you figure out the game. The game is a third person shooter and actually plays great. I love the weapons that are upgradable and you feel like being very limber and able to attack at a moment's notice. Best part of the game is that you have the option of a four player co-op campaign. Trust me, this game is near impossible so you want to have friends while you yell at the television. While you transverse from world to world, you'll learn to fight or die. I probably died over 30 times trying to get past the first world with a friend. Once we memorized and upgraded our weapons, figured out the mini bosses, we actually made it to the first level boss who became near impossible with the help of his exploding friends. Even learning isn't enough in this game. You will need to play this game over and over again, picking up the game's currency so that you can buy or upgrade again and again. I understand in a free-to-play game to grind this much, but not in a paid one. This game drove me and my friend crazy with how much we put into the game, thinking we figured it all out, and then throwing an impossible boss that you have to go back and grind some more. Only game that I'm willing to do that for is an, for an RPG or a Fantasy Star Online, which I finally quit as well. If you are into the Soul series and games impossible to beat, like the original Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles on the Nintendo, then this one is for you. The rest I have to say is that Remnant from the Ashes is just too frustrating to complete. That's it for me on this episode on Beho Reviews. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos. Beho out and Greg, take us out of here.